What is up YouTube? I'm back once again with update 27 of my DIY Tesla Powerwall. Now today is going to be a short video where I show you guys basically the balance between every cell um, as they approach uh, full charge which is roughly 4.1 volts which is what I'm going to be doing it at. That's what I have my uh, solar charge controller set at. So um, right now we've got um, 28.9 volts charge in these batteries with 15 amps going into them and from the solar panels we have 68 volts at 6.5 amps so you can tell that this is true MPPT um, we're getting you know a step up in volt a step up in amperage and all that so um, we're charging pretty well now it's a you know sunny day and all that so um, we're getting some real power into these batteries so I'm also drawing a 300 watt load ish so that's obviously going to bring the pack down a little bit but um other than that that's all we have on it i'm going to be putting the aircon on it soon and i will see how long it lasts and i might do a follow-up video to that but um i'm hoping um that fan isn't too loud but i'm going to show you guys the voltages and uh see where we're at first pack is at 4.7 volts second pack is if I can actually get it on 4.07 next one 4.08 4.06 that's a bit lower so you can see from the last video these voltages have basically stayed the same um, you know as in like the balance between each other so there were a couple of you know volts out or millivolts whatever but um it seems that from charging they've stayed the same this is the final pack 4.02 so this one was always lower i still haven't managed to get a bounce stop but um from that you can definitely see that the balance between the packs has stayed the same and it's not deviating which is good um you know that's thanks to the uh, capacity test i've done on all the cells and you know i've made sure they're all balanced and stuff so um it's definitely paid off i'm very happy with that um, so right now I'd just like to quickly show you with uh, one kilowatt worth of load. So you can see we've got 1.5 kVA or basically you know a thousand watts. So this is as much as I've pulled from it. Um, the wires are getting warm-ish, not really that warm. Um, obviously they are too thin. I'm going to get a couple of those and have those in parallel to uh, beef it up a bit. But um, with that we have 12 volt, 12 amps of solar coming in and 20 amps of uh, converted power going into the battery so um, that's pretty nice and I can do some quick voltage test in the last cell 3.98 and then the next cell is uh, 4 volts so um, you can't actually see what I got but um, trust me it is really well balanced I'm um, just like to share that with you guys and uh, yeah, it's balanced across the board. It's you no know, balanced top end, bottom end, and even under load. So I um, can't really complain with that. Very happy. And uh, yeah, um, hopefully next video I'll do a bit more of a load test as in how long it takes to discharge. And uh, yeah, I'm very happy with this 15 amps solar charge going in, which is really good. Um, I've only got six panels hooked up out of eight. So uh, yeah, I'm very happy. Uh, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Please give it a like and subscribe for more DIY Tesla Power update videos. And I'll see you guys in the next video.